Hello everyone, this is Zahid from Inspire and Ignite and uh, it's been a long time I made any, any video for Inspire and Ignite and after a long time I decided like let's make a video. I've been receiving lots of emails asking me about uh, how to start preparing for getting just a couple of months now, maybe three months. You know this three months is a very beautiful time. I have been reading a lot of stories about people who have cracked one of the few of the world's trickiest exams, few of the world's toughest exams in three months preparation. <clears throat> When I read their stories, the most prominent thing for me was to see what they have done actually and what all those people have common in all of them. I realized few points which I would like to share with you and it's a reminder for me and you, everyone who is trying to take the exams, competitive exams. So the first thing is in three months, they three months before when they decided, they immediately got into the plan. They plan the whole three months, every single day, how many hours they are going to spend on the exam and the, how many quality hours they are going to spend on the exam and uh, how they are going to divide the time between weekends and holidays when they get more time and when they have a daily regular job or, or a college, how many, how many hours they are going to spend on, on, on the gate exam every gate or any competitive exam every day. <clears throat> So once they decided about that plan, they got all the material required for them. Even they had to pay for it, they paid for it, and they got all the material ready for them. If they cannot afford to have every single book read, few of them also registered for like online courses or something like that. And I think forget, I posted one post on, uh, there is a post on Inspiring Ignite saying that like video lectures for gate preparation and all. IITs and NPTEL and MIT open course and all those things are doing a really great job. So I think you can definitely find a, a very nice uh, offer, a very nice lecture series there that can help you in, get your, in your get preparation. If you're not able to read the book, you got to make a plan, alternative plans for it. So all those people who cracked the exams in three months, they, they planned it well and later they got into the material and once they got into material, they were sincere about their effort. So all these three things are very important. It's not that like IAPL is coming and uh, some event is coming and some movie is coming and you're waiting for it and then finally you also want to crack the gate. It will not happen in three months that way. So the most important thing here is you got to get up now, you got to plan, collect all the material you need in a week time and make a strategy and study plan. I have written a lot of posts about how to start preparing. I usually prefer like in the morning if I want to prepare, if I want to read something which is very difficult and I it that really annoys me, what do I do is I read something which please me first in the in the in the first session. Maybe like spend like maybe 10 20 minutes and get warm up and then start preparing for I start digging into the the thing which I don't like. So you have to know yourself and then you bring all this all these things together along with your hard work and effort, then things will be very all right for you. Be sincere and plan properly and then keep track of yourself. Another very important thing they all have done is they kept track of their mistakes. <clears throat> when you do a mistake, you should know why it is a mistake. And if it is a mistake, how you are going to correct it. And when next time you see a similar problem, you should not repeat it. If we keep repeating our mistakes, there is no way that we can crack any exam. So it is it is really difficult to I mean I mean catch up in the exam because you don't know what kind of mistake you are going to do in the exam. So it is like really difficult to evaluate yourself and then punch a card on that. So and the another thing is just remember people never fail actually. If you look into people's life, they never fail. The only thing that happens is that they give up. That's all. That's all is the, is the magic of the game. So it's all up to you how how far you want to play the game. And uh, you know, gate is entirely a different ball game. It's not like you are writing your end term exam or mid term exams or internal exams or something like that. Gate is a multiple choice exam, and you will have to play a different different game there. I have friends. I have known people. I have friends who have worked very average in their colleges. They are very averaging private colleges and they cracked the gate in a best possible way. And they got into IITs 
And once you get into IIT and then you feel like a few of them felt like not good about it, one IIT, so they took gate again and they entered to another IIT. So this is also possible. So the only thing is <clears throat> when you're playing a game, you got to know the rules of it. So G, uh, uh, gate is entirely a different exam I'm, I'm, because my exam is different. So the exam I'm preparing for is, is different from my tongue is always sleeping a lot that time. So anyway, so the more important thing is you never got to give up. You got to get up, plan well, collect the study material, go to university, I mean college library, university library, whatever it is, prepare well and have a good target for yourself. It is not that like, okay, just I want to just crack the gate or just qualify the gate. It doesn't bring anything to you. Take a tougher challenge, dream of IITs and the remembrance, the memory of the goal will make you work hard. That's the only thing. If your target is very small, just cracking the gate, then you will never talk about it and neither you will talk about it nor you will, you will be serious about it. If your target is you are dying to go to IITs and then you are preparing for gate, that's entirely a different taste. Because the moment you feel weak and lazy, you will remember the goal. Yes, I'll be there in IIT in a couple of months. That's three months it need from your life. So, so that that feeling, that memory of the goal and the prize, will make you work hard. So never ever give up, and giving up is just a kind of losing. So, I'm just making this video to make sure that you all start preparing for for your gate exam very seriously because just three months left now. So you will have to you will have to start preparing. Complete the syllabus as soon as possible, then get into the practice. Do a lot of, lot of, lot of practice. Even if you have to buy some questions from somewhere, do that. Because this investment, because MTech is an, if you consider MTech as an investment, this is another investment. <clears throat> and if you can give like 100,000 rupees or 200,000 rupees for MTech fee, but why can't you give like thousand rupees for, for some exam, some some number of questions? But to buy the number of questions, you got to prepare well before. So spend your enough time in preparing <clears throat> and planning and preparing and being sincere. So then the rest of the things will follow it. I hope I convert the message and I wish you all a very, very good luck for the gate exam and any other exam you're preparing for. And I I definitely ask you to subscribe to Inspiring Net because last time someone commented on, on my blog saying that why would you always ask people to subscribe to Inspire and Ignite if they like it, they subscribe it. Many new people come here so they might not know about uh, subscription and all that. So I just prefer to say it by which it's, it can be a reminder to the people that are not subscribed. They can get the updates, video updates for, for get exam, not only get exam and take admissions but some other personal stuff too. So, I, at the same time, I'd like to ask you to subscribe to Inspire and Ignite too for, for more updates and details. So, I hope you got this video useful and with this I wish you all a very good luck and thank you so much for watching.